If you've ever felt insecure about something because of something someone said, or somebody's like, blue eyes are the prettiest, I love blue eyes, but then you're like, ah, I have brown eyes. This analogy is for you and you need to hear this. Ooh, bear with me. Okay, so let's pretend you're a product at a store, okay? And just because this one type of consumer or group of consumers wants this product, doesn't mean the company is gonna be like, you know, we gotta get rid of this product here. We gotta get that off the shelves. No, okay. Now maybe you'll come back and say, but what if this product never sells? Wouldn't they take it out then? Okay, yes, yes they would. But that ain't gonna happen. Okay, because there are so many different products and so many different types of consumers that there has to be at least one for everyone, okay? Now, in this scenario, you only need one person for your product, right? Because most people are monogamous anyway. So that one person is going to buy you over and over again, and they're going to want you over and over again, and they are going to keep you in stock. Supply and demand, people. It's simple. You are going to be in such high demand from that person that they're going to need to keep a steady supply of you. They ain't getting rid of no best-selling stock over here. Uh-uh. All right, so what I need you to do is forget about the people who made you feel like you weren't special or pretty enough or you didn't have the most desirable features because you know what? They aren't your consumer, so why would you want to conform for them and be bought by them anyway? Also, side note slash epilogue, I think brown eyes are really pretty, especially in the sunlight.